In a recent report by Bleacher Report's Alex Ballantini, the Dallas Cowboys are evaluating the possibility of adding a seasoned linebacker to their roster, and the top name on their radar is none other than Deion Jones. Ballantini suggests that the Cowboys should consider the free agent market for a linebacker, especially following the season-ending injury to rookie linebacker DeMarvian Overshone. With Overshone on injured reserve due to a torn ACL, Dallas found itself with a crucial gap in depth behind key linebackers Leighton Vander Esch and Damon Clark. Deion Jones emerges as a compelling choice for the Cowboys. The veteran linebacker became available after the Carolina Panthers released him. Notably, Jones has a history with Cowboys defensive coordinator Dan Quinn. He began his career with the Atlanta Falcons in 2016, where he played under Quinn's coaching during Quinn's tenure as head coach with the Falcons, extending until his departure in 2020. During his time with the Falcons under Quinn's guidance, Jones showcased his talent with four different seasons of over 100 tackles, including a Pro Bowl selection after amassing a career-high 138 tackles at the conclusion of the 2017 season. Impressively, Jones ranked fourth in the NFL in tackles during the 2017 season. Ballantini highlights that Jones's most successful years coincided with his time in Atlanta when Dan Quinn was the head coach. The 28-year-old linebacker is already familiar with Quinn and proved to be an asset for the Cleveland Browns last season. While Jones may not be at his Pro Bowl level entering the 2023 season, he still brings substantial skills to the field. According to Pro Football Focus, Jones earned an impressive 87.6 defensive grade in the 2017 season, followed by grades of 73.7 in 2018 and 76.6 in 2019. Once again, he ranked fourth in the NFL in defensive grade during the 2017 season. In more recent times, Deion Jones spent time with the Cleveland Browns, appearing in 11 games and making 2.5 sacks and 5 starts following his midseason trade from the Falcons in 2022. However, his performance fell short of his peak in Atlanta, reflected in one of the lowest defensive grades among linebackers, scoring 48.3, with at least 100 snaps last season. Although Jones signed with the Carolina Panthers during the offseason, he was released before final roster cuts in August. The Cowboys, while not expecting Jones to return to his elite linebacker status from his early career, view him as an ideal candidate to bolster their linebacker position, particularly in the wake of Overshone's injury. Currently, Leighton Vander Esch, Devin Harper, and Damon Clark are locked in as starters. Overshone's injury represents a significant setback as he was a standout among this year's rookie class and was expected to make an impact this season. Head coach Mike McCarthy expressed his regard for Overshone, stating, He has stood out from the first time we got in the meeting room. You could see his ability right away. Obviously, you feel terrible for the young man. Adding Jones, who was initially slated to play under a one-year, $1.2 million deal with Carolina before his release, could prove to be a valuable move for the Cowboys offering depth at a position currently lacking it.